Welcome to the Harvest USA Report. I'm Brian Hale, an original production of Howard Hale Broadcasting, now expanded throughout North America. If you're looking for information about the harvest that you hear on these reports, make sure you visit our Harvest USA Report Facebook page. All this information is contained within. The Harvest USA Report has been on the air since 1997, a long-standing tradition of timely information. Let's take a look at what two different crews are doing as they wrapped up Texas. It's Kwasniska Harvesting out of Kansas, writing, Texas is a wrap. We battled mud, high humidity, and the occasional rain shower, but Mother Nature cooperated just long enough for us to finish before the big rains hit. A big thanks to Colby, Bryson, and Claxton for your efforts and commitment to take care of our farmers. Next up for them, they're headed for Oklahoma, northbound. Here's a poem from their very own Bryson Bergkamp. The road is long, the road is tough. We leave in May and are gone for around 200 days. With family and loved ones back at home, sometimes you can't help to feel all alone. When we feel a little lost, may we all run to you when this field we call life gets a little too rough. Dear God, thank you for this life we live. For if it is your will, keep us safe on our way and return home so we can be custom harvesters yet another day. That was by Bryson Bergkamp. C&K Harvesting and Trucking wrapped up the Texas harvest in two weeks this season, with wheat which had been grazed and some damaged from wild hogs, averaging around 15 to 35 bushels per acre. We found no shortage of wild hogs and even some snakes. We're happy that we're able to cover as much ground as we did before the rains moved in. Thankful for the safe, uneventful move up to northern Oklahoma. Excited to get into the field soon, as it looks to be a beautiful wheat crop in the area. C&K Harvesting and Trucking that's going to do it for today's Harvest USA report. Thanks again for listening and may God bless. I'm Brian Hale.